Today, Mommy had taken Caillou and Rosie to get their eyes tested at the optometrist's. Mommy, why do people wear glasses? Glasses have special lenses that help people see better. Do I need glasses? Well, that's why we're here, Caillou. The optometrist is going to do some tests on your eyes. Caillou didn't like the sound of having his eyes tested. Hi, you must be Caillou and Rosie. I'm the optometrist. My job is to test your eyes to see whether or not you need glasses. What kind of test? Don't worry, they're fun. Come inside and I'll show you. Why don't you take a seat, Caillou? What are those? These are a special pair of glasses we use to test your eyesight. If you're having trouble seeing, I can change the lenses like this. Whoa! Everything looks fuzzy! What about now? Yeah, that's much better. Okay, Caillou. I'm going to show you some letters, and I need you to tell me what they are. That's an A! Very good. Do you know any words that start with the letter A? Um, apple. Apple. That's a good one. What about this letter? That's a C for carrot. Excellent. Mommy says that carrots are good for my eyes. That's right. Eating fruit and vegetables is very important for keeping your eyes nice and healthy. Caillou thought the eye test was a lot of fun. Okay, Rosie, it's your turn now. Caillou could see that Rosie was looking a little nervous. Don't worry, Rosie. It's fun. Okay, Rosie, can you tell me what this is a picture of? Excellent. What about this one? Ooh. That's right. Well, I think that's enough testing for now. Why don't you go and take a look at some glasses while I look at your results? Mommy, Caillou, and Rosie looked at all the different types of glasses. What about these ones? Mommy, these ones are too big. I look silly. Well, what about these then? These are cool. They're like something a spaceman would wear. Great news, Caillou. You both did very well on your eye tests. You and Rosie don't need glasses. Aw, but I really like these glasses. Here you are. You can wear these whenever you like. Awesome! Thank you! Caillou was happy he had good eyesight, but he was even happier he was able to keep the spaceman glasses. Hello, I am King Caillou. What's your name? I'm Queen Clementine. It's nice to meet you, King Caillou. <laughs> What are all those boxes for, Daddy? Mr. Daniels down the street is moving house, so we're letting him borrow these boxes. Caillou <gasps> thought that the boxes looked like big building blocks. I know. How about we build our own castle? That's a great idea, Caillou. You can be the king, and I can be the queen. I'm going to build the walls. I'm going to build the tower. Finished. Lower the drawbridge, Clem. Wow, this place is huge. Hello, Queen Clem. Hello.
Hello, King Caillou. Shall we go to the top of the tower? We can see the whole kingdom from up there. Okay. Wow! We're so high up! From the top of the tower, King Caillou and Queen Clementine could see for miles around in every direction. It's so beautiful! This is the best kingdom ever! Let's go and sit on our thrones! As King Caillou and Queen Clementine entered the throne room, they were shocked to find that somebody was already sitting there. Hey! You can't sit there! Only a king or queen can sit on the throne! Me-queen! Me-queen! Oh! <laughs> it's you, Rosie! Rosie, you can't be the queen. Clementine is the queen. It's okay, Rosie. You can be the princess. There. Pretty. Oh no! The castle is under attack! It's a giant! Okay, playtime's over. We have to take these boxes to Mr. Daniels now. Oh, but we were playing king and queen. It's okay, King Caillou. I'll bring them back for you to play with once Mr. Daniels is finished with them. Yay! Caillou had loved being the king, and he couldn't wait to build another castle with his friends. Caillou is going swimming with Mommy and Daddy. Here we are, Caillou. Are you ready to practice your swimming? Caillou checked that he was wearing both his armbands. They would help him stay afloat. Yup! Caillou looked around and was very excited to see a slide leading right into the pool. Look, Mommy! A slide! Wait, Caillou! Caillou, you mustn't run at the pool. It can be very wet and you could slip and fall down. Look here. See, rule number one, no running. Caillou wanted to be safe at the pool. Sorry, I just wanted to see the slide. It's okay, Caillou. Now, let's take a look. Caillou climbed up the ladder and sat at the top of the slide. Come on, Caillou! I'll be right here to catch you when you land in the pool. Caillou looked down at Mommy in the pool, but now he was up here, it looked an awfully long way to the bottom. I got too scared. It was a lot higher than I thought it would be. Never mind, Caillou. Let's go into the pool from the shallow end. Caillou climbed down the ladder into the pool to join Daddy. That water was just the right height for him to stand on the bottom. Better? Much better. Look, Mommy, I'm swimming! Very good, Caillou. How about you try to swim to Daddy? Caillou swam towards Daddy. That's it, Caillou. Just a little further. I made it all by myself! You certainly did. Caillou watched as Mommy swam under the water. He was very impressed. Ta-da! Caillou wanted to try and swim underwater too, but his armbands wouldn't let him sink. Caillou, you can't go underwater with your armbands on. Shall I hold on to them for you? Caillou wasn't ready to take off his armbands just yet. It's okay. I'll go under the water <laughs> another day. <laughs> hey! No running! Hi there. What's your name? Caillou. Hi, Caillou. I'm the lifeguard. My job is to make sure everyone is safe at the pool. If I see anyone being unsafe, I blow this whistle. I saw those children running over there. That's against the rules. That's right. And thank you for calling out to them.
Caillou remembered what Daddy told him about running at the pool. If you run at the pool, you could slip and fall over. Exactly. Here. Now you can be a lifeguard, too. But only blow it if you see someone breaking the rules, okay? Caillou felt very proud to be a lifeguard. Say, have you tried the water slide yet? It's lots of fun. I tried, but I got scared. It's okay to be scared, but a brave lifeguard like you has nothing to worry about. Well, I guess I could have another try. Great! And don't worry, I'll be watching to make sure nothing unexpected happens. Caillou climbed up the ladder once more. It still looked a long way down. I'm here, Caillou. Caillou was ready. He counted to three and then pushed himself down the slide. One, two, three! Oh, Caillou, you did it! What a brave lifeguard you are! That was amazing! Did you see the big splash I made? Can I do it again? Daddy, the pool rules said no grown-ups on the slide! Caillou was very happy. He would never be scared to go down the slide at the pool again. Caillou was in the garden, waiting for his friends Leo and Sarah to come over and play. Look who's here, Caillou. <laughs> Hi, Leo. Hi, Sarah. What are those, Leo? These? They're donut seeds. <laughs> donut seeds? How do they work? It's easy. All you have to do is plant them in the ground, and they'll grow into giant donut trees. Caillou hadn't heard of donut trees before. Wow! That's amazing! I can have donuts whenever I want! What happens now? Now we have to water them, of course. What are you doing, Caillou? I need to water the donut seeds so they'll grow into donut trees. Donut seeds? Yeah. Leo gave me these donut seeds. See? Oh, Caillou. I'm afraid your friends might be playing a little April Fool's Day prank on you. What's April Fool's? <laughs> it's a day when friends play tricks on each other for fun. Those donut seeds are just breakfast cereal. <laughs> April Fools! We tricked you, Caillou! Caillou was very disappointed. He was really looking forward to having his own donut tree. I don't like being tricked. It's okay, Caillou. Everyone gets tricked on April Fools' Day. Why don't you try and play a trick on somebody? Okay, I guess I could. Caillou found Rosie in the living room, playing with her building blocks. Hey, maybe I can trick Rosie. Look out, Rosie! There's a spider after you! <laughs> Run, Rosie! It's going to get you! What's all the racket? I was playing an April Fool's Day prank on Rosie. Caillou, that wasn't very nice. Rosie is too small to understand that you were tricking her. Caillou felt sad that he'd upset Rosie. He was only trying to play a prank like Leo and Sarah did. Sorry, Rosie. I didn't mean to upset you. How about you all go into the kitchen? I think Mommy has made you all some special treats. Who wants a lollipop? I do! I do! Wow! 
Wait a minute. This isn't a lollipop. April Fools! Hey, you tricked us, Mommy! <laughs> Would you like a lollipop too, Rosie? Yay, carrot! Caillou had lots of fun learning about April Fool's Day, and he hoped that maybe his donut seeds would grow into a donut tree after all. Caillou and Rosie had spent the whole morning shopping for groceries with Mommy and Daddy. So as a special treat, they had taken them to the toy store to buy one toy each to take home. Wow! Look how many toys there are, Rosie! Toys! Toys! Remember, just one toy each, okay? Look! Squishy balls! They just look like regular balls. What's so special about them? They're really cool. When you squeeze them, they change color. But you never know which color you're going to get. Yellow one. I want yellow one. Caillou could see that Rosie was still too little to reach the squishy balls by herself. Here you go, Rosie. Say thank you, Rosie. Thank you. Okay, are you ready? Three, two, one, squeeze! Wow, you were right, Caillou. They do change color. Is this the toy you want, Caillou? Caillou thought that the squishy balls were really fun, but he wanted to look at some other toys before he made up his mind. Maybe we should look around a bit more first. There might be something better over there. Caillou could see a girl playing with a toy he'd never seen before. Hi! What's that toy you're playing with? It's a fidget spinner. You hold it between your fingers and spin it. Once it's spinning, you can do cool tricks, like balance it on the end of your finger. Here, you try. Caillou took hold of the fidget spinner and spun it between his fingers. He could hear it making a little whizzing sound. Great! Now, try to balance it on one finger. Looks like you need some practice. Never mind, Caillou. Let's try again. Ready? I'm going to let go now. I'm doing it, Mommy! Look how it spins! It's like an airplane! Great job, Caillou! Caillou, come and look at this! It's a spaghetti-making machine. First, we have to choose a color for the spaghetti. But I thought spaghetti was always brown. This is special spaghetti. It can be any color we like. Caillou had never heard of different colored spaghetti before. Wow! Even blue? Of course! Yellow! Yellow! Thank you, Rosie. Now we can have multicolored spaghetti for dinner. Caillou watched as Daddy placed the blue and yellow dough inside the spaghetti machine. It's ready. All you have to do is press down on that lever. It looks delicious! <laughs> Sorry, Caillou. It's not real spaghetti. It's just for playing with. <laughs> What's the point of spaghetti if we can't eat it? Whoa! Did you see that? Hi there. I'm Jessie. Hi! I'm Caillou. I was trying to catch that truck, but it was too fast. Oh, you were very close. I almost crashed trying to escape you. So you were driving it. Can you teach me? You make the truck go forward by holding down that button there. And you turn it with those buttons there. 
great job, but be careful. If you go too fast, it might crash. Whoops! I'm sorry. That's okay. You almost had it. I can help you. There you are, Caillou. You shouldn't run off like that. We didn't know where you were. Sorry. I was learning to drive the truck, but I crashed. Well, at least you're helping clean up the mess you made. Caillou could hear something rattling around inside the eggs. Hey! There's something in there! What is it? It's a surprise. Each egg has a different toy inside. And sometimes it even has sweets and stickers. Caillou thought that the surprise egg sounded amazing. Mommy, I want a surprise egg! <laughs> Good choice. I think Rosie has decided too. Okay, here I go! What surprise did you get, Caillou? I got some colorful sweets, some smiley stickers, and a toy truck! Amazing! Caillou was very happy with his surprise egg. Now he could practice driving at home. <laughs>